I'm, overall, just kind of how you feel about this win. I mean, uh, um, I think you guys had like 24 turnovers. There was flaws to the win, but you got it. <laughs> yeah, 24 turnovers is... Wow, I didn't expect we're going to have like that big number, which is like way above we should have. I think that's a kind of like problem. Sometimes some games we are okay. Some games we are like turning over too much. 24 obviously is like too much, but you know, we find a way to get a win, but obviously that's like a biggest concern, you know, from this win. So if you want to win in a, in a, in a, in a multiple times, if you want to compete like every night to be able to get a win, you know, of course we need to take that number way better. So I hope we're going to do it. So you seem surprised by the, the number of turnovers. Did it feel like a game where you guys were in control of the ball or did it feel sort of hectic? I mean, obviously we play fast, you know, we try to, you know, get all guys involved. It's not just like ISO things. So, you know, obviously teams who are playing like more ISO ba basketball is like they have a less turnovers. But we try to play fast, you know, try to play both sides, you know, a lot of splits, a lot of cuts, you know, obviously that number is going to be a little bit bigger, but like, you know, 24 is, is much, you know, and it's good, you know, it's the beginning of the season, so we can see like where we are right now, you know, what we should do better defensively, offensively, obviously offensively, that's the one of the, you know, best thing that we can improve. You guys played the Spurs in the preseason slate. Where have you seen Victor Wimanyama's game maybe improve or change in the last month so far? Uh, obviously, you know how it, is, how it is in NBA. Sometimes, you know, all these hype things, you know, you're like more energized. You are like more there. Once the season starts, you know, 15, 16, 20 games in, you know, sometimes, you know, people scout you and that kind of stuff. Sometimes you're going to go, you know, play good, play bad. Obviously, he's rookie. I think it's a great future in front of him. You know, we all have that kind of slumps, up and downs, you know, and uh, I hope he's going to figure out, you know, for the San Antonio Spurs. But, you know, obviously, like, great talent, you know, with that size, able to shoot like that, you know, and block the shots around the rim. It's just it's hard to play against him. So, you know, he's going to have up and downs. It's just beginning for him. You've averaged over 18 on 60% uh, shooting in the last three games. How have you just kind of felt in the flow of the offense, your rhythm lately? Yeah, I would just kind of like go with the flow, what you say. I didn't think about like, should I score? Should I be more aggressive? And I was like, you know, just go out there and play with the, play with the, what game gives you. And obviously, you know, some teams gives you more space, some teams less, but you know, try to play, read the game as best as I can. I think that's why they kind of sign me here, you know, to just play on the, on the flow, play how I feel, you know, they kind of trust my decisions and, uh, you know, I try to be calm and make the best decision possible in the moment. Is this kind of as, as open as you've been consistently from three uh, at any point in your career? I mean, I think I had a better percentage, you know, my, I think, second year. I think it's what I say, it's just beginning of the season. We, we are like, what, seven, 17 games in, you know, I'm going to be consistent some games, some games I'm going to miss, you know, but try to, you know, overall be in a point to don't take so much to heart, you know what I mean? Because maybe next time I'm going to be open. So, you know, I think it's a, it's a work thing, but it's a lot of mentally thing. You know, you have guys who are great shooters, one on zero, but like when it comes to the game, it's just like mentally thing. So I try to, what I say, mentally be like as best as I can to be clear, to take open shot to don't hesitate and you know I think I'm just doing right so it's hard to say. Do you, did you find yourself caring about like the in-season tournament stakes that were on the line tonight? Uh, 
it's obviously like I play that kind of stuff in Europe, like like similar kind of thing, similar format, and it's like every game kind of mirrors or you are out, especially if you have like you play for the big team, you are favorite in that game, you everybody expect from you to to win. But here is like NBA, everybody can win, you know, against everybody. So it's not that kind of like game on the line, but it's coming there. I really like it. I really like it. That kind of format, you know, makes you dive in into every game. Even, even, uh, you know, I try to be focused on every game, but like even this kind of tournament, everybody kind of want to be good, play good, these kind of games and try to finish, you know, in the end, you know, I think everybody want to win end of the day, you know, I treat, you get the trophy, you get the money. So, it's a little bit different, courts a little bit different. I think it's a little bit different vibe, and, and I like it. It's not just like a same, you know, NBA for 82 games. Sometimes it's like every game is coming is the same. This game is like a little bit different, you know, refreshing, and I like it. Do you expect Tuesday to be pretty pretty amped up? What did you say? Do you think Tuesday sh will be pretty amped up? I mean, that that might be for the you know your group. I think guys talking about that in the locker room, you know, like, let's win next one, you know. What if we win that one? Can, like, I don't know, Minnesota or OKC, the game, what can happen? So people are kind of diving about that, you know, think about the points. So I think, like, people are talking more about their game, you know, to finish with the points difference and that kind of stuff. So I think players are diving, you know, what I see in the, in the, in the locker room. I think it's just beginning, you know, once the I think in the future it's going to be even even better once the players kind of learn how that works. Yeah.